Mehwish from the U.S. Uh, Sheikh, I wanted to know what is the punishment for rape, and is the victim required to forgive their oppressor? Jazakumullah khairan. What jazakum? Mehwish says, what is the punishment for rape, and is it recommended that we forgive the rapist? I'll start from the second part of the question. No, it's not recommended to forgive the rapist. He's an oppressor. He has committed a heinous sin. And forgiveness cannot be recommended unless there is a benefit from it or that the consequence of it would be positive. If someone is used to abusing his teachers at school, and this happens a lot, and he had beaten one of the teachers. All the family relatives go to the teacher, oh, he's a, he's a kid, he's just a teenage, forgive him. And he knows that if he forgives him, he's going to next week beat another teacher. And he's going to break the windows of a third uh, teacher. This person is not to be forgiven. He has to pay for it. But if it is a mistake from a person who is not known to do mistakes, yes. And it's not as big as this mistake, because rape is not a mistake. It's something that is done, uh, uh, pre, it's premeditated, it has a long process, and it shows the evil in that person. What's the punishment? This is up to the Muslim judge to decide. Technically speaking, if the perpetrator was not married, this is considered to be fornication. Forced fornication is worse than consensual fornication. And if it's forced with life-threatening uh, um, situations, like under um, the, 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 uh, 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 the threat of a weapon or killing, then this becomes closer to hiraba, an execution is due. But if it was not any of those, it was only uh, a forced fornication, this is punished as fornication, which is flogging a hundred lashes, if he's unmarried. And if there are no other circumstances that would increase, the judge can put him in addition to that, like five years in jail, whatever the judge sees. And if it was under the threat of uh, uh, death or, or killing, it can be execution. If he was married or previously married or widowed or divorced, then the punishment is execution on the spot by stoning. And this is the adulterer's uh, punishment in Islam.